Ladies, gentlemen, and those who refuse to pick a side. I've only got an hour, which isn't much time to try and answer this little question of mine. And by the way, yes, this whole part is going to rhyme. So sit back, <laughs> relax, and strap in. And if that's not your thing, try and fit a nap in. <laughs> Any way she wants it, give yourself over to the yonic. Love her taste like it's the dankest chronic. Laugh it up like gin and tonic. Spell out letters like hooked on phonics. Then throw her into histrionics until she racks up bows like rings in Sonic. <laughs> I'm so sorry, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Or anybody who had watched a Disney flicks wishing they could look like Belle when she descends the stairs all donned in gold with perfect hair to waltz across the ballroom for Walt's oldest time song. This doll had a gown that you could wear. Or your brother could. <laughs> it doesn't matter if the clothes in your trunk weren't designed for someone with your junk in mind. Or if you like putting liner around your eyes, or only feeling your own skin in latex thigh highs, or right letting guys slam your colon like semis. <laughs> Not the kind that are blue, often brown, Star Trek green. Some of you starting to see what I mean. Not the ones between ears, but the ones between shoulders, the kind girls develop as they get older. That fill out our sweaters when the weather gets colder. The chest mounted mountains that make you feel bolder. Want to reach out and hold her and fill you with fire so every look smolders. Breasts? <laughs>